Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In two days, I'm actually heading to Coachella. So today, I'm gonna actually be showing Will my outfit. Yeah, I don't know if I'm 100% happy about this because <laughs> I'm gonna tell you even before the video starts and I've seen any of the outfits. I'll tell you something, I'm not gonna like them. So Jessie's obviously going to Coachella on her own. She's leaving in two days. Obviously, I'm gonna be staying on the farm because I have to help, obviously, my family lamb. Yeah, so I am going with a brand and like when I got asked to come to Coachella the first thing I asked is can will come uh, because I think Coachella is just like really difficult to get accommodation for everything unfortunately they said there's no plus ones whatsoever which meant that's I had to sad <laughs> that's I so so sad but uh, do you know what it's so difficult to to get into do you know what I mean yeah no I'm really really grateful to be taken with the brand but I then got worse news. Well, it's good news, but it's bad news. Like, I should be excited, but I'm actually going to be at Coachella on Will's birthday. <laughs> so, yeah, Will's going to be here working on the farm while I'm at Coachella. And, like, I think it's a big thing to, like, go to a music festival in another country without your boyfriend. Yeah, 100%. It's, do you know what? It is like the worst time in but we've had we've had kind of like big conversations about it and a lot of time and depth went into kind of like thinking about it because i think we're both worried on either side yeah do you know what i mean yeah. it's obviously being apart for that time and obviously coachella is like you can't get much bigger than that every person <laughs> is the person is gonna be there how are you feeling about it i don't know like i just feel really awful that i'm missing out on will's birthday i feel like but disclaimer everyone if I never have a birthday every single year, do I? Like, mm. I've never had a birthday in the sense that, a bit last year when we came out of the villa, we went for, for a nice meal, but kind of like previous to that, I've lambed, I've worked on the farm every single year on my birthday. So I've always celebrated it at the end of the month. And that's what we were gonna do this year anyway, even if Jesse was going to Coachella or not. Yeah. So the birthday was gonna get pushed down to the, to the, to the end of the month, just so I can help my family lamb. Like, priorities, families come first. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Um, but, and this is, you, this is one of your dreams, isn't it? To go to Coachella. Yeah, I can't believe I'm going to Coachella with a brand. I remember being like 15, 16 and you like saw like, influencers and stuff do this and I'm like oh my god How's I'm one been? of them this year what the heck I'm not even gonna lie I was jealous <laughs> like we, we love white folks big up white folks we folks. love white folks but fox. when they said no to me I was upset <laughs> I was sad I was like really really you don't want to take me I literally said to them I was like oh can I go to like a different weekend so it doesn't fall on his birthday but unfortunately not so it took I me really <laughs> wanted to go I really wanted oh to go oh my god we'd have so much fun together yeah it would be the dream oh. it would be awesome but we can't and we We've got to deal with that. Yeah. Um, how are you excited though? I'm excited, but it's like a lot to prepare for. I think like everyone just scrutinizes people's outfits and like their makeup and their hair. Me, I think. me. This is what's gonna happen in this video. I'm gonna scrutinize Jesse's <laughs> outfits to tell you if there's a little bit too much sun, sun. I'm gonna tell you there's a little bit too much sun, sun. Yeah. <laughs> and you'll be putting on that jumper, girl. You will be putting on that jumper. Off the top of my head. It's gonna be hot in Coachella, okay? So I, I'm gonna be completely honest, I don't think you're gonna like the outfits. <laughs> I'm known for wearing small clothes, like. So bearing in mind, this package has been sat <laughs> in the house for what, over a week? And yeah. we've gone, no, we're gonna do a YouTube video out of it. Yeah. You know, I'm gonna rate your outfits. So this is the first time I'm seeing the outfits as well. So these are gonna be real raw reactions. I can tell something. I don't think I'm going to be happy. I tell you that much. I don't think I'm going to be happy. Yeah, I don't think he's going to be happy either. I had a little look at them last night. But as well with the outfits, just keep in mind, I haven't got accessories for them yet. So I'm going to get a lot of stuff when I get to LA because I've just left everything to What do you need to get there. when you get to LA? Like belts, jewellery, hats. Yeah, so. th this is last minute. Jesse, you'll probably be at Coachella by the time this gets posted, but I'm taking Jesse to the airport in two days on Tuesday. And the girl is not ready. She's not packed. I am not she, ready. She hasn't got anything. She was like, she hasn't, you haven't fake tanned. <laughs> nothing. Nothing. The only thing I've got is these hair extensions. The girl is leaving it last minute. Yeah. Do you know what? Whenever I stress about something, I just leave it to the last minute because I'm like, oh, I'll deal with that later. <laughs> mm, but we're going to deal with it now. Yeah. I'm going to be the judge. I'm going to sit here. He's we're got gonna... a little notepad. He's going <laughs> to yeah. judge me on. Yeah, I'm going to rate him. And then I think if I'm not happy, I'll be hunting in the wardrobe, picking you, probably jogging, <laughs> jogging bottoms, jumpers, owl. <laughs> Should I wear this? Yeah, no, I'll be your. You have to let me to do your makeup for. for my Pajella. makeup. I'm doing my hair and makeup on my own. Do you know what? I think I'm going pretty basic. So who? You go, who? So obviously you're going with a brand. Who? Who's going to be there? 
Um, I know we've got Chloe Burrows, Millie Court, Whitney from Love Island, yeah. Anastasia. Oh, we love Anastasia. Yeah, yeah. Mm. We've got a good group of girls. Yeah, and they're all staying in like a villa. So How many of them have boyfriends then? Millie and Whitney do. Yeah, that's yeah. who you'll be chillaxing with. Of course. That's who you're gonna be chillaxing with. No after party. I'll give, <laughs> I'll give you no reason to stress. I'll keep you up to date with everything. Okay, well, okay. I'm glad you said that because I've actually made a couple of rules. No my, rules. A couple of rules myself. Just, I haven't, I haven't actually showed these to, <laughs> to Jessie okay. yet. Okay. But there are a couple of rules that I would like, um, like you to do. Okay. okay. Number one, I want you home before midnight. <laughs> Okay. I'm an early sleeper. No, I'm not really, am I? I want you on... <laughs> <laughs> Snogged off in bed by midnight. I'll tell you something. When Jessie's out, she's out, out, and she's not coming home. That's why this is number one. Home before midnight. Girl, stop it before it even starts. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Disclaimer, just want to say these are this all... This is light-hearted. These are jokes, people. Don't take it seriously. I want yeah. Jesse to go out. It's funny. I want Jesse to get <laughs> fucked up and have a good time. But these are my rules. Isn't it funny, though? Will, you literally have to encourage me to get out of the house. I'm mm. such a homebody. So For he sure. knows that I will abide. Okay. Number two. <laughs> Number two. I want to be the first one to see the fit check. I don't want Snapchat, <laughs> Instagram, TikTok, seeing the fit check... What? The fit check. Seeing the fit check before me. I want to be the first one. Okay. Okay. Tick. Number three. This is, this actually should have been number one on the list because this is a really important one. Buy a SIM card or buy <laughs> data. The amount of times Jessie has gone on a trip and gone to a different country and not charged herself up with data or another SIM card. She can only message me in the <laughs> hotel and bearing in mind the time difference is absolutely whack. Like she'll go on this trip and I'll be like, oh, well, that's been great convo, babe. <laughs> so that, no, Number three is a must. Yeah, do you know, I actually lived in the UK for like six months and didn't even have a SIM card. Yeah. The only way I could message is if I was in somewhere with Wi-Fi. The girl was, spot. the girl was on crack, like she's crazy, <laughs> honestly. And then it was really funny, she would like store up all of her pictures and like everything and then be, as soon as we get home, post them all. <laughs> Number four, no after parties. No after parties. Unless it's Lana Del Rey, maybe. <laughs> oh my God, imagine that. If Lana Del Rey was there, I would die. Oh, you could be. You could be going to the after party. No, I'm not that cool. Don't you worry, Will. This one's actually a serious one. Stay in groups and be safe. Yes, Stay in groups. Always, all the girls go in, you need to be in groups. No one gets left behind. No yeah. man gets left behind. And that's anyone else going to Coachella too. I think it's always important or to anything. have safe people with. Or anything. Yeah, anything. Yeah. Stay safe. Keep everyone updated on where you are. Number six, when you're at Coachella, mm -hmm. and this is the last one, I want you to make me feel like <laughs> I'm at Coachella. I'm talking about, I want Snapchats which are an hour long <laughs> of people's sets. Lana Del Rey, no problem. I want to see however long she's on stage for. I don't even know. I haven't even bothered upsetting myself and looking at who's playing, so. Lana Del Rey's who I'm most excited to see. Yeah, yeah, but they're my six rules. Okay, done. That's easy, because I am. Lit I will spam you. I will, I'll FaceTime you. Bear in mind, I'll be working and Jesse will probably be messaging me. I'll, like, I'll be the one, yeah, I'll be sat there gritting my teeth, <laughs> covered in absolute sheep shit, with my hand up a sheet going, <laughs> This is my life. Really? I'll keep you updated. I'll have fun for you. Really? Well, well, yeah, without further ado, let me get my tears out my eyes and cry myself to sleep <laughs> after I see these outfits. Let's get these outfits on. Please bear in mind I'm not fake tanned, okay? Don't judge me, okay? Jesse is just about to come in with the first outfit. I'm quite excited to see what kind of like the fit is. Coachella's quite a big, Coachella's a big moment regardless. So come on. <laughs> Outfit number one. Hate it. <laughs> so, this hate is that. what we've got. Let me just make sure this is fitted right. That's so sick. <laughs> yeah, white boots. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> she fucking hate that. <laughs> so, what we've got here is, this is a detachable top, right? So, she Why gets too hell? hot. Why is it? What do you mean a detachable? She, she gets take, too hot. She ain't got sleeves. You ain't detaching nothing. No. And then, <laughs> get out of here. This is how <laughs> you'll be fucking wearing this. No. <laughs> That's actually not a bad idea. But <laughs> get them away. Right, now you can show the camera. This, okay, in all fairness, this actually does not look bad. 
Yeah, get them away. So with this, it is actually like see-through, as you can see. I've got skin-colored underwear on. Yeah, I think, what would you wear though? I think I'm gonna wear white. Yeah, good. Like white underwear, yeah, so you'll you be able will to be see it. Underwear. <laughs> I need to take this off. Look what he's done. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to take it off of you? Ah, uh, I'm stuck. That's actually that actually doesn't even look bad. Oh, honestly, love it. You do? Love it. So this, and then you can't actually see, but I've got white cowgirl boots. <laughs> so this is like my all white day, and I'd actually like this to to wear this the day I see Lana Del Rey. And what I want to do is maybe you guys have to let me know in your opinions i was thinking about doing like half up half down with a big bow or i can have a flower crown because no yes. you look too cute no i'm actually not having it <laughs> or a cowgirl hat <laughs> i do you know what i actually quite like the cute bow idea i want like a big bow in my i want head. you to shave your fucking head off <laughs> <laughs> i want you to go bold so you like it you think it looks good though love it i think it's a really really right. sick outfit you do yeah <laughs> what do you I need to see you rate it out of 10 I think they're all gonna be 10s really I don't know about the other ones but this is one of my definites I think is that your favorite what actually people if you if you know write them in the comments what is the aesthetic for Coachella it's like whatever you want I think everyone's going like real casual lately but I'm like I'm going to a festival I'm gonna have fun not too much fun. <laughs> I haven't gone to a festival in ages either, so okay. Festival Jesse is here. No, you guys... boring <laughs> Mum Jesse. Mum Jesse. I'm actually I've got two days to impregnate you so you can't have a drop of alcohol. This Still. could be one of my last festivals before I'm Mama Jess. So. Yeah, but yeah, love that. Outfit number two. Ready? Yeah, come on. Why are you giving me a bit of a suspense? You can't see the full thing, and I think it would look better with black underpants on. But we got this little lace bodysuit, and it goes flared at the ends. <laughs> what were you thinking? <laughs> I must admit, I've not got the right color underwear on. It actually does look better when I've got different underwear on. Hate. It's giving festival though, isn't it? It's giving I hate that. <laughs> Never wear that in your life. What? Don't wear that ever. You do like it? Yeah, I do. I love it. I'll just show you the detailing. So I think it's like really good for like shaping. As you can see, it is a bit see-through, which we got to work with, but that's okay. Love that. Really do like... Well, I, is this that, is a different vibe. Did you like that? Because they've got the trousers on and the really high boots. It actually makes me look a lot taller than I am. Like that. I like that. You like it? Yep. What are we going to rate this outfit? Let us know in the comments which are your favourite outfits. It will look so much better when I have the correct like underwear on, but... William, what's your rate for this one? Yeah, love again. Out of 10? They're too nice to wear. Too nice? <laughs> uh, have I you ever seen me dressed in something I'm like this? I'm getting more worried and worried every time I see these <laughs> outfits. Yeah, they're honestly, they're beautiful. Like, love... What would you call that? Catwoman. Catwoman, yeah, it's giving like black cat energy. Black cat energy, no. <laughs> you're not being a black cat energy out there, I tell you that much. I'm your black cat. Actually, I think I'm a golden retriever girlfriend, <laughs> but. <laughs> yeah, love that. Different vibe, love though. Mm. Love, love, love. Thank you. What are you thinking about the hairstyle? I reckon ponytail. What do people think? Yeah, ponytail would look really cool. Yeah, for sure, ponytail it. Ponytail? I prefer, I'm preferring the white one. I think white's a bit more my colour. However, that's really nice. This is like a quick change from last Do you time. like that? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I don't know if I'll get too hot in the desert though. Is it a desert? I don't N know. Nah, it's like see-through, babe. You what if get... I get weird tan lines? <laughs> what if you don't go? <laughs> hmm? Do you want to see the next outfit? Not particularly. This is just... <laughs> This is deflating. This is just making me go, oh, <laughs> seriously? You've got to go Coachella looking like that? I wish you were coming with me. Yeah. Let's have a look at the next outfit. We are moving into outfit number three. I'll tell you something, people. I'm just, the more the outfits come out, the sadder I'm getting. I'm like, seriously, actually show me another, just show me a rubbish outfit so I can go, cool. I think this is going to be your favorite one, Will. I'm waiting for the tracky freaking bottoms. <laughs> you ready? Brilliant, yeah. This one's a little bit more plain. Now that actually is giving Coachella. <laughs> that is giving Coachella. The hat is kind of like not fitting. I need to like readjust this because it's been washed around everywhere. That and is I... definitely giving Coachella. What is what is that material? It's a little lacy material and it's like ruffled. So I don't think the camera's actually doing it as much justice as it deserves. Do you <laughs> like that? Yeah, I do. So I've actually got a belt for this and I'm telling you the belt is going to make it because the belt will give me a little bit more definition around here. And then I've got... Oh my God, turn the fuck around right now. Is your ass out? <laughs> is your ass out? 
Put it away. It Let's see, I'll put it down. Yeah, but it's actually not pull it up because that's how it's going to be in the festival. <laughs> what the I flip? Don't, I don't Get want... your bum away. <laughs> put your bum away. I don't want my bum to be out, but it's just how it fits. We've been in the gym doing squats and stuff. Really? I liked it up until I saw your bum. There's always a catch. But yeah, I'm going to get a belt for this. I think that outfit is really giving Coachella. So I actually could have got this dress in the white. And I'm like, should I get that when I'm in LA? You look like a fucking cowgirl. Yeah. Where are your fake guns? Bow, 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 bow. Looks like a cowgirl. Got the boots. What do you rate this outfit, William? I, I love that. I think that... Out of all of them, although it's probably not my number one, I feel like that's number one Coachella. That really is giving Coachella. I think that's a lot more stand out than the number one, number two. Yeah, I'll get in a little bit closer to show you guys. Like but I do, I do get what you mean by the belt situation. Once I get that belt, it's like a really thick brown belt. And I think it's just going to pull it in and give it a little bit more shape. Well, without further ado, I, I want to play a game. Okay. <laughs> and the game I want to play is, um, what would you do in Coachella? Okay. <laughs> and basically, you're going to play you, and I'm just going to play some people you might interact with there. Okay. And I want to see your reaction, okay? All right. Scenario number one. <laughs> what are you doing? Hey. Hi. What's your name, pretty girl? <laughs> I'm Jesse. I'm Will. Nice to meet you. Hi, Will. The fuck are you doing? <laughs> You're my boyfriend. Have you said a different name? The, I'm playing a man out in Coachella and you're grabbing my back. I thought, okay. We do. <laughs> I thought, because you said Will. I, at first I was standoff, but then you said Will. What? So if you meet a boy in Coachella because it's called Will. <laughs> well, obviously it's not going to be We you. do. Okay. All right. Hey, pretty girl, can I buy you a drink? <laughs> no, thank you. You sure, man? You look first, yeah. I don't, we're, we're still on a friendly thing. A friendly thing? Yeah. <laughs> I guess if you want to buy me one. <laughs> I'm joking. Why are you laughing? <gasps> I don't want to take you serious. Why are you talking like a child? You want me to get you a drink? Yeah, two Jager bombs. <laughs> you want a Jager bomb? Sure. What the fuck are you doing? Let it out. Do shots with other boys. This isn't a joke. <laughs> no. Redo. Okay. All right. I can't stop laughing at the accent. Hey. Hey, how you doing? My Hi. Name, my name's Jeremy. Nice to meet you. Hi, Jeremy. No handshake? No. Why? I just don't want a handshake. I've got a boyfriend. <laughs> he, well, is he here? Where is he? I can't see him. Yeah, he's He must be a little here. punk anyway, little bitch boy. He's at home. Oh, he is, I bet he is a little no, punk. No, he's not a punk. He's a lovely boy. He's a little bitch. He's lovely. Oh, I like You're him. a punk. Yeah, I like it when you step in those cowboy gold boots. <laughs> You're actually an idiot. Is that good? That is all right. Grab my face and go fuck off. All right, I'll just be dancing. How would you react to someone's dancing like this and be like, I want you to This is this exactly part. how I'd react. I'd pull this face. All right, what about this? And walk away. Hey, Jesse. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Fucking good. Brilliant. Let's try that again. You're doing that to every person that no. approaches you. Hey, girl. <laughs> We're per the perfect dog match. What if someone says that? How are you going to react? React quickly. Can I lick your head? No. Punch me. I'm trying to. Good. I'm trying to grab your hand. Punch. Fuck off. Okay? Okay. I think we've done enough training. You think I'm trained well? Yeah, let's do that one more time. One more time. And this is the finale. Is this all of the... Oh, it's all the white fox a lot. No! Uh, girls, what is she doing? Oh, no! oh, she's being crazy. Oh, what? Me and all the boys can come to the after party and stay in Jessie's room. Nice. Hey, Will. No Hello? No one's gonna say that. Hey, Will. Hi, are you all right? You're... What's up? Oh, your girls uh, said that all the lads can stay in her room. You fucking what? Really? Let me call her. What is going ah! on? Bring, bring. Hello? What the fuck? Why are you all What is going on right now? That's me. I don't think that's gonna happen. I want you to bark. In my throat. I, to, I don't give a fuck. Barley cough sweets. <laughs> barking at every lad. Okay. On my Coachella list, barking at every lad. Okay, bye bye, 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 bye. Get over there. That's <laughs> not happening.
We're moving into the last outfit, outfit number four, and me to probably ultimately cry because <laughs> Jesse, what sort of outfit is this? This is like my proper festival girl, kind of like rave vibes. Party. <laughs> Party girl. And we I can ready? Just imagine what this is gonna look like. <laughs> okay, I don't know if it's too much. Too much. Put, them, put <laughs> like them the glitters away. are too much. Like it. But yeah. we have the detachable sleeves once again. We've got like we have to have like a glittery day, so I can put like the little diamonds on my face. Yes, I've got the little shorts. I'm a shorts girly. I love like. I just I feel like really comfortable like this. You know, Do I don't you? get too sweaty if I'm dancing. I, I'm getting confused because the glitters on your sleeve are di different to the glitters on your bra. So this isn't like what I actually intended it to be worn with, but I don't have the other shorts yet. Either that or I have to have a plain black bikini top, I'm thinking. Right. Because I thought on the website they were gonna match. Or I was thinking I could actually wear this top with denim shorts and like a um, a cowgirl hat, but not the black one. I'm liking the glitter. I think at Lena Festival, you do need glitter and like the diamantes on your face. Do you know what I mean? It giving give that party girl vibe. Yeah, one of the days we'll have like festival girl, like glitter, I'm trying to take this off. <laughs> I have another glittery top as well. Um, I'm just gonna quickly go show you. This one probably goes better, I don't know, but I can't be bothered trying them all on. So this one is kind of like same vibe, but we've got different diamantes. Yeah, I like them diamantes more. Yeah, that, should, oh, oh wait, that's way more Coachella. Yeah, wait, let me go try it. That's way more Coachella. I don't know how this goes on. Ready. Bring in the second one. Yeah, so that's this Coachella. is the second top. Yeah, that's Coachella. That's definitely Coachella. If I'm, if I'm seeing Coachella somewhere, daddy, it's definitely Coachella. And then do you think it goes with these shorts or different ones? I can get plain black ones. I have plain black ones. I think plain black would actually go better. Or denim. I mean, there's too many, yeah, there's too many shiny. and it's not matching. Diamantes. Yeah, there's, it's not matching the diamonds. Yeah, I don't know what I did with my order. I just must have messed it up somehow, but. But I think the bra, that's very Coachella. That's very, yeah. very cool. That's very sick. I'll definitely, I'll definitely do that, babe. And that is a wrap for what I've got for you today. So I think the last outfit is just like a little bit undecided, but the other ones you seem to like. I like all of them. I think honestly, jokes aside, without me crying, I just think I, I think they're all fucking incredible. I think that you look so good in them, and you will look so amazing during Coachella. Yay! Thank you. <laughs> and they are all the Coachella fits. They're still kind of like undecided, and they don't have accessories yet. Mm, yeah, I think they all look really, really good. I think you've got, so Jessie's got a, a gift and suite when she gets there as well. So everything she's got now, she can go to a gift and suite and uh, have a little look. But I feel like a lot of people do get judged on their outfits. So yeah. I kind of like understand. I feel like a lot of people do get judged on their outfits at Coachella. So it is a kind of like backhandedly feeling your pressure because I know you've been a little bit stressed about it. Yeah, no, I think it is stressful and people always, I'm not like a fashion person, okay? I'm just going to have a good time. Like, yeah. I personally like the outfits. I know it's going to be hot. Like, I'd rather be in a little bikini top than sweating my ass off. For sure. Like, yeah. let's be honest. I'm actually even a bit worried about wearing the high boots because I don't want to get too hot, but you know, it is what it is. But I think there is like a lot of feelings and emotions. Like, I'm obviously going to America without my boyfriend, which yeah. is really sad. I'm going to start on your birthday. And as well, last year when we went to Chicago, my drink actually got spiked so going mm. to a big festival actually haven't been to a festival um since i don't really go out that much especially without will yeah yeah um, it was a really really tough time and to be quite honest we were like in the we we'd just been to a baseball game and it was yeah. very very touristy and i guess for you going to a bigger environment where it's probably easier yeah i think you probably you do get worried which is so okay you yeah. know you'd like um, that's why I'm a little bit worried as well because I can't protect Jesse. Yeah, you were there. Will was there to protect me last time I got spiked. And the thing is about spiking, you can't control it. No. Like there's nothing I can do. No. Um, I have got drink stoppers. Oh, I've actually got them sitting here. So I can like put these on the tops of my drinks. What are they? They're like little covers. So they're like stickers I can like stick over. And then you stamp, you put your straw through. And then uh, I've got straw stoppers too. And I also have this other thing. Yeah, definitely take them. Yeah, it's like it looks like a scrunchie and you wear it on your wrist and you put it over the top of your drink so no one can spike you. Not that I like am intending to get spiked, but now I'm like, I kind of have that because, fear. Yeah, because Jesse's been spiked, you will have a fear of it. And I think it's very, it happens quite a lot now. And I don't think, I think it's, I think it's a really sad world that we live in that you're even going to bring these cup covers and spiking is a thing. I think it's a really, really sad world that we live in, Great. to be quite honest. However, I think you have to be real with the situation that goes on and it does go on. And I would hate for anything to happen to Jesse while you're out there. We've got the Coachella fits sorted, kind of. The next steps are to pack. Yeah, so we've got, have you, you haven't even got your cosmetics or anything like that. Are you bringing anything? Um, just my standard makeup bag. 
<laughs> yeah, maybe we'll do that. But yeah, the next day is just for Jesse is packed. So she's tomorrow. You've got all day tomorrow, and then Jesse's yeah. leaving the next day. And I tell you something. The girl, the, she's not ready. <laughs> I'm not ready, no. So I might go do some last minute things tomorrow, but you know what, it is what it is. As long as I've got me and my phone and some outfits to wear, I'm gonna survive. So thank you so much for so watching. Much. We're loving them at the moment. We're so close to 20K subscribers. We might have even hit it by the time this video is posted, but if we're not real, Push, please. <laughs> Real push. Because yeah, you're... if you're watching the video, please subscribe or click like. It would actually really help us out. Yeah, we'd love it. We read all the comments and everything like that. But you're in for a treat. We've got Jesse is gonna go OTT with content out in Coachella because I think this is a new experience for herself, and I feel I, I feel like you really want to share it with everyone. Hundred percent. And I feel like sometimes when I'm alone, it's actually nice to vlog, and it's really nice to be able to show you when I get back. So for sure. Hundred percent. We'll be vlogging everything. If there's anything you want to know. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Until next time, my people. Bye. Love ya. Bye. Bye.